Hey everybody, welcome to another review. Um, I had some time tonight, so I decided I'm going to do one more uh, review. This one is uh, concerning Returnal uh, Pro, their newest version out there. I got a trial for it. So I went installed it. Um, let me just go over quick what it comes with. It comes with uh, an antivirus, real-time antivirus. Uh, it comes with the virtual mode, which uh, is standard for return now, even in the free version. Uh, you have a <clears throat> system restorer, and you have your status here. Um, the antivirus is fully updated. There you go. And the only thing I have left to do is, oh, and you guys are probably wondering why I have Hitman Pro installed here. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn on the virtual mode and uh, download and try to run a bunch of viruses. The problem is that if I try to scan then with Hitman Pro, uh, Returnal won't let the driver properly embed itself in the system and scan because it's trying to scan from inside the virtual mode. So for it to work, I have to install Hitman Pro first and then return now. Um, so when I do scan with Hitman Pro, it actually works to show you that the system is infected. And then we'll restart and the system should be clean. So let me turn on virtual mode here. Okay and then it will automatically turn itself off when I um, restart the computer and it should clean everything up automatically. Now we'll also see in this test how well their antivirus works. I don't know what antivirus engine they're using. Uh, I haven't looked around too much. Maybe somebody can find out for me. I don't know if it's their own or um, if they're leasing somebody else's. So let's do some testing here. Okay, that one was found by the antivirus. And we'll close that. I'm sure now it wants me to restart, which is why you're seeing that. Okay, that one didn't work. that that one. Some of these are already kind of going dead. Okay, that one was found, so it's going to quarantine it. Okay, that one wasn't working. Looks like this one's working. Maybe not. Okay, that one was found. And now it was quarantined. Okay, and the last one. That one wants internet access. That is the one thing that I uh, s that's missing, in my opinion, from Returnal is a firewall. Uh, that one wasn't working. Um, the Windows firewall is okay, um, but there's better options out there. So now we're going to do a scan with Hitman Pro to see if the system, now the virtual system, should be infected. <clears throat> and then when I restart, it should be clean. Now, I don't know if um, Hitman Pro will actually find those infections or not. That's kind of hard to say. 
I've never tried doing this this way so this is a kind of an experiment right now but you did see that some of them are malware and they really are there okay so that says it found nothing um, see I don't know how I can scan the virtual mode inside the virtual machine um, it's a little weird but I'll restart it and uh, I'll be back when um, it's done restart well what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna restart and then I'm going to do a full system antivirus scan with Returno so I will be right back alright so I finished scanning and um, I didn't find anything so let's now do a scan with Hitman Pro see if it finds anything then we're going to do a scan with um, Malwarebytes and um, we'll see if that finds anything so I will be right back okay so uh, Hitman Pro didn't find anything so that's good to see and last but not least I'm going to do a scan with Malwarebytes also while that's getting set up let's check out see how much RAM usage we got here and do my usual quick little check so you can add uh, 34 megs or so it's a little high but it definitely doesn't slow the system down so that's nice to see I didn't notice much of a slowdown okay so I will be right back okay so uh, Malwarebytes finished scanning and it didn't find anything so um, looks like uh, Returnal did uh, pretty good I actually deactivated the antivirus uh, while scanning because it was kinda slowing down uh, Malwarebytes so there you go there's uh, looks like they're still doing pretty well um, I'm not a big fan of virtualized systems but if um, you know if you like these types of programs then this is actually a pretty good one um, there you go don't think I think I have anything else to say or cover about it uh, let's see here we have a little bit of time so let's see if make sure okay virus quick scan okay you can do um, you can adjust the product sensitivity so you can uh, lower it or increase it depending on um, on how sensitive you want the antivirus to be everything's out of quarantine you can see the logs that it found Eldorado uh, let's see what else Eldorado, uh, Heuristics, uh, that was a TDSS, That's a that was a rootkit I think if I remember right. So it definitely protected. You can, uh, if you go up to preferences here, you can change uh, some different settings. You can change the settings of this little um, toolbar. You can take it away completely if you don't need it you can uh, adjust it um, what else here password protection uh, let's see of course you got your virtual mode different tools here file manager file protection virtual disk or the drive um, virtual disk is where you can save your files Oop. Uh, different settings you can wipe all disk changes at computer startup um, drop all changes which is what I did um, trust uh, system services from real disk so that's why I ran hitman pro from the real disk uh, real-time analysis 
Uh, this is all system restore, different settings for system restore, and you got your status. So there you go. Hope you guys enjoyed this review, and um, take care.